I thought I was about to get slapped in the junk right there, son. Play that big one. Get him. Get him in the boat. Let me have it. It's a giant. What's going on, folks? Good morning. Welcome back to your Lake Fort Guide. It is a pretty exciting morning for me, honestly, because I know a lot of you guys have asked to see Ray Hubbard, wanted us to go film on Ray Hubbard. Well, we're here this morning, and we have Ray Hubbard now featured on the Fish Life app. I got my boy Michael and my boy Michael. But this guy's really, is that scampy. How you like your shrimp? Scampy. There it is right there. That's scampy right there, y'all. So we're gonna be using the brand new Ray Hubbard Lake Levine combo package. Today we're on Ray Hubbard. We're gonna be going to those fish life spots using. We're gonna show you, as you guys can see right there, that blue dot is us. That red dot is the spot we're starting on. So here we are on our starting drain. We're gonna take you guys along for the journey as we use the Fish Life app to break down Ray Hubbard. So y'all stay tuned. Go ahead. <laughs> what in? No. I mean, is that a bass? It's like it looks just like a bass, it's just smaller. I mean, it's close. It looks like a bass. It's close. It looks a lot like a bass. Look how look how big that is. That's what she I said. This is what you call the triple decker. That's the patent move, patent pending, patent pending move, scampy Come. move. The triple decker up here, boys. Come permits near you. There's only a few people on earth that I would fish three on the front deck with, and you two are one of them. That you two are one of them. That adds up, yeah. Mm -hmm. Land that big one. He's coming. Get him. Get him in the boat. Yes. Let me have it. Let me have it. It's a giant, dude. I'm talking about. Look. That's a. I mean, that is an ass. I'm talking about a tree pounder to end all tree pounders, huh? Oh, this is a trophy class tree pounder out here. We're gonna go ahead and let this one go because we want to make sure somebody else has a chance to catch the tree pounder of a lifetime like this one right here, right, Mike? Not every day you get one in that man. I mean, that is a nice tree pounder right there. <gasps> we should have took a picture. Dang, gum it. All right, guys, we have now moved spots. Didn't work out on the first spot. We caught, but we did get a bite. We caught one little, well, we missed a couple bites and we caught one little one there. Um, now we've gone up the river. We're on the next spot on the app. Oh, scant. God dang, why don't you give me a heads up, son? Why'd you almost, like you said what it. What kind of hook set was it? It was you one that caught it, boy. You said it in my, my nether regions. <laughs> Man, I had to. I didn't mean to. I just. I thought know. I was about to get slapped in the junk right there, son. Show that. You're going to have to get that one close. He's <laughs> <laughs> solid. Three or four with a slash in the middle. Yeah. Three, three quarters of a pound. Three quarters of a pound. <laughs> That's like that triple meat burger down there at the yeah, Dairy Queen, yeah. son. Mother, the hurt child. Boy. Watch out, little burn side. I'm about to flip this right here. That's how you do it. That's a good one, boys. I want to shake it. Now a little weightless. That uh, that new six cent stick bait. That clout, weightless Texas rig. Nice in there, boys. A little weightless Texas rig on a three out EWG. Get you a good chunk up here in the river on El Hubbard. Give that one an ear scratch. He'll come back and see you when he gets a little bigger. What on earth? Man, that son of a gun is fighting her. Boy, I'm talking about, boy. <laughs> it's, it's not, it's, it's like a bass. That's a bass. Say it with me now. It looks a lot like a bass. It's not a bass. But it's smaller. Let me see if I can, that is a, uh, I mean, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, it's not even fair for me being out here right now. <laughs> Listen, I'm the best there is. I'm just a big hairy American winning machine. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if y'all saw that hook set. <laughs> that stuff was gonna come out of the water on me. Oh, did he get it? He's got it. He's got it. Watch that sucker swirl at it. I drug it off that little padded duckweed or whatever it was. Watched him eat it. That was cool. 
Well, he ate it, ate it too, Jack. <laughs> there we go, folks. Another little chunk, little little chunk junior is what we're gonna call that one right there. Well, guys, today we're out here on Lake Rahub, and what an awesome lake it is. It's not what you normally see on my channel. Normally, I'm out in the woods of East Texas. As you can see, Ray Hubbard is very much an urban fishery, but it's a really neat fishery. It's got a lot of features. It's, like I said, in the big city, lots of traffic, lots of building, lots of development around the lake. It even has the world-famous Bass Pro Shops right here behind us. But make no mistake, we may not have been catching the biggest fish so far today, but Ray Hubbard absolutely has giant bass swimming in these waters. It's a really high quality fishery for people to get out close drive to all you guys that are in the city and go catch very much bigger than average bass on a fairly regular basis, especially if you go download that app and use these spots, you know you're gonna be around the quality fish. It's gonna cut your learning curve. It's gonna keep you on them. You can have confidence in what you're doing. It's gonna clue you into the patterns year round. But Ray Hubbard is located just to the east of Dallas, Texas, right between Rowlett, Royce City, all that stuff's around here. Uh, Lake Levon is just north of Ray Hubbard. They almost connect. They kind of do connect in a roundabout way if you go far enough up the river, but they're really close to each other. Both great lakes with really big fish in them, both right here in the Metroplex. So when you get a chance, go download the Fish Life app, subscribe to Ray Hubbard and Levon, and go explore these awesome fisheries right here in the middle of town. Square bill. Yep. Nice one. There's a brown the rocks to the structure's blue square bill up shallow, bouncing off the rocks and got a good two pounder right here. There you go. Good, good job, brother. Point. On the Fish Life spot. Folks, we moved over to uh, another spot on the Fish Life app. Uh, this is a stretch of obviously rip rape rip rap bank rip rape back. Rip rap bank. Uh, as you can see behind me here, a lot of road noise. We're right by a major road in Dallas, and there's loud noises. What they say? What they say? Anchorman, loud noises. Yeah. <laughs> this is not East Texas fishing, bro. This is not East Texas fishing. No. Nah. Hey. Look how he ate this dude. Choked it, Jack. I'm talking about choked it down, son. Absolutely swallowed. Yeah, oh yeah. Hey, that's a dang catfish. You just stagged him in the butt. You butt hooked a catfish, Mike. Get on that Fish Life app, folks, and get you some frying pan sized catfish anytime you want them. <clears throat> what is that? What in the world? That is two catfish, two bass. All right. Well, we talking about the Fish Life. If you need to, if you need to stink the grease, folks, <laughs> it is 1,000% August in the state of Texas because here it is. It's right at noon, like just a little bit before noon, and it's like un unbearably hot as you can see no wind at all unbearably hot guys the fish were not really cooperating very good for us on hubbard today now we caught a few decent ones we were on our way to turn back we're quitting a little early right. and then this ding dong in the back over here is over here catching catfish when y'all know y'all better tell him in the comments how wrong because i hate catfish I hate, mm -mm. he tried to catch a snake too he did try and catch a snake i should let him catch a snake I don't like beating up on miners, but I almost did. I got, <laughs> how close was I? Hey, it's. I had to tell him, hey, I'm not playing. You cannot catch that snake and just say, mm mm. But, anyways, Ray Hubbard was a good time. Mike, thanks for showing me around. Mike took no me problem. out here. Mike knows how to run it. Mike knows the lake really good. And I don't, because I've never really been here. But we were able to get out here, use that Fish Life app to put us on some bites in the month of August. Tough time of year. And a few bites that, honestly, this time of year, you'd want those in a tournament bag. Like they no were not about. giants, they weren't big giant fish, but you absolutely would be wanting those in your tournament bag this time of year. So uh, that's how it went down. Like we said, we do show you how it goes down, whether we catch them or we don't, and that's exactly how today went down. So that's what we showed you. So that being said, thank you guys for watching. Go check out the Rake Lay Hubbard, Rake Levant, Rake? Lake. 
Dude, I can't even talk. The Lake, yeah, my mind has melted. The Lake Ray Hubbard and Lake Levon combo package on the Fish Life app, brand new. It's up on the Google Play Store for Android devices. It's also up on the web app at fishlife.net. Now for you iPhone guys that want to be on the Apple App Store, we are literally at their mercy. As soon as they'll publish it, it'll be up. We've done our part, we're waiting on them. So that's gonna be available as soon as Apple decides that it's available. It's kind of the, right. Apple is a pain in the butt. Like, I'm not, I don't want Apple mad at me, but Apple, you guys suck, so go ahead and get mad. And other than that, we will see you guys next time, right here. Or we're gonna see you, Mike. You're late for it, guy. You gotta do that with more guests, though.